this video we'll take a look at the insertion sort algorithm. So an insertion sort is quite simple in the way that it works. It steps through a list of data and for each item that it comes to, it compares it with the previous items of data in that data set. And if it's greater than the previous item, then it's inserted back into the same position. However, if it's smaller than the previous, it's compared with the item before that and before that and before that and before that until it finds an item that it is greater than and greater than and then it is inserted back. So let's have a look at that in a visual way. So here is a set of data. If we were to um, look at the seven, the seven would be compared with the previous item, with the five. And because the seven is greater than five, it stays where it is. We then move up and we have a look at the next item, which is two. The two is compared with the seven. And because it is less than the seven, they will, well, the two will come out and the seven will move up to fill its, spa uh, its space. The two is then compared with the five. And because the two is less than the five, the five will move up one place. And then the two will be inserted into the first position of that array. Like so. Now we are looking at the next item in the array, which is the number three. The three is compared with the seven. So the seven will move up. The three is then compared with the five and because three is less than five, the five will move up. And the three is compared with the two and because the three is greater than two, it will be inserted into that position there. And at this point, our data set is now in order. So in terms of an algorithm in pseudocode, here you can see that we've set up a loop which is going to loop through each item of um, data in the data set. And whilst the position of the current value that we're looking at is um, greater than zero, which means that we haven't yet got to the, to the start of the data set as we are comparing trying to compare the previous items. Um, so whilst we haven't got back to the start and whilst uh, the value that we are currently looking at is um, in, in the array is greater than the one that we're trying to reinsert back in, then what happens is the item of data before the one that we are comparing with all previous items, um, the one before moves up to the right so it goes into the current um, values position and then we just um, reduce the position of focus by one and that continues until we find a place where either we're at the start of the array or um, where we have a, a value that we're trying to compare that um, the value that we're trying to insert back in is greater than a particular item in the data set. 